Yo, what's up everybody? It's TJM Dub. I'm coming at you again in the video. Today I'm doing a review of my new flip out radio. This is the Power Acoustic uh, PTID 8920B. It's a flip out screen. Um, just got this in. Um, you know, the company sent it to me. So I put it in the car and I thought I'd go ahead and do a review for you guys. Sorry about this thing. This is my graduation thing. Um, the way I got this in here, I don't want to take it out because it was damn near impossible to get it up. So just don't, you know, I can probably just fold it up. And there we go. It's out the way. All right. So um, here's the radio. Uh, same, you know, everybody know flip out screens or whatever. So um, same, you know, thing. You got the volume. You got the, um, and this is a Bluetooth image. You can do calls and stuff. So you got the, the skip buttons, the phone features on the skip buttons. You got the modes. Uh, play button scan as far as radios um, um what's a usb aux port open eject release to take off the whole that uh, the whole little face play here mute button same stuff um let's go ahead and flip out the screen Okay, now um, you probably just realized what I just did. I pulled it out. This radio, um, for guys who've been watching my channel, um, I used to have a boss flip out screen. The boss flip out screen used to, this radio is really not even in the dash. It's not, it's so long that like it, it messes up like with my, my piece of plastic that goes across the car. It messes up where it can't even fit in all the way. So. I'm going to eventually have somebody, I'm going to probably pay somebody like professional or something to get this thing in all the way. But, um, you know, never mind about that. Um, but yeah, flip out. It has this, um, radio feature here. You know, guys know, I don't have the radio antenna hooked up, so there's no sound. Um, touch screen. So you get radio, your disc, USB, um, SD card, which the SD is, I believe inside of this, um, matter of fact i'm not even sure we're gonna see real quick yeah sd card is right here so that's the sd card and with me doing that i just made it go off so we're gonna plug this back up and there we go we back at it there we go so that's what it does flips in and out um so sd card is in there uh, Bluetooth settings and then it has the AV so you can hook up like DVD player game system you can do all that shit so um that's that um so um overall I like it man it's a very good um you know flip out screen um it is better than my boss one I have to say it is better um the only thing that my boss that the boss one does better than this one is the boss one has um you can't you can't play with the um the display Meaning, like, on the balls, you can up the brightness, you can up the contrast, you can up the the sharpness, everything. Make it look pretty damn good. On this one, you can't. It's just brightness, and that's it. So you can't do all those extra features like you can on the um, on the boss one. Um, another thing, um, I think that's it. Other than that, this radio is really better. Um, you know, USB, you plug it, well, you got to have it. Um, this is where I listen to all my music on. I got like hundreds of songs on this. So you just plug it in. It instantly starts reading. Um, you just wait on it for a second. There you go. You got all your music. You know, turn it on, whatever. So another thing about this radio that's different. If you start from zero and turn it up to like 15, you'll hear like, you won't hear like a sound increase. So you gotta turn it up slow to hear the sound increase. Now watch. See that? You see I turned up to like, You see what I'm saying? It has like a delay in like the volume. See so you, you see how I just turned it up to 50? There was nothing until it kind of settled and realized that, okay, he turned the volume up. Let's go ahead and turn up with it. So um that's the thing about that. But other than this, I mean, it's a good radio. You can click on each songs, you can go back so I can go back and you know, I can go all the way back to my last album which is the Wiz Khalifa album um, I can go up to seven you can click it and you can choose the you know each little um 
little, you know, these are all the albums. It's very good. Um, Bluetooth, Bluetooth, um, with, I'm recording with my phone, so I can't use the Bluetooth. Um, Bluetooth is good. The only thing I got about it is it doesn't, um, I bought this radio. The radio did not come with the, um, it didn't come with the mic. So the mic doesn't, you can't, you can't talk. Um, so you can't talk through like, like on my pioneer radio, on my pioneer radio, it had, it came with that thing. So, you know, that's where the mic set. Um, but this one doesn't have the radio, um, videos. I'm still to this day trying to figure out the video format and the resolution so I can put videos on the SD card and play videos off of this. Um, don't really know how to play videos off of it. Um, well, I know how to play videos off of it. I just don't know. I gotta get online and get the um, and get the what's the name? Get the like the user manual or get something to tell me what the resolution is and stuff like that. Um, AV saying you know what AV is basically AV right now. If I hook the AV in, uh, it'll just work for the um, the aux cable. But once you like hook something up back there, um, you know it'll actually work. So that's tilting, and as you can tell, it's fucking up because the radio ain't in all the way. So, um, we gonna put that down and flip it back up. I know I probably should have got this set up right before I actually went and made a video. There we go. You gotta have some pressure. There we go. Once it got pressure on, it works. So, um, that is pretty much it. Other than that, you got CD. I don't have a CD to put in it. Um, it works with DVDs, but I don't have a movie in my car. Um, if you know, I did. But you guys get the concept. I mean, everybody pretty much knows. It's basically a radio with the TV version. So that means you get to watch video stuff like that. Um, but like I said, it's bright. You know, in daytime you got a glare. Like right now, you can see my hand. You know what I'm saying? It has a glare. Um, but overall, it's just a it's really good radio. I, I I can't really knock it. Um, go to settings. Settings. You got your bass, treble, um, balance, uh, faders, beeps, loudness, subwoofer, um, equalizer, display. Like I said, this is the display. You see, all you got is the backlight and the screen, and that's it. Nothing really to play with. You know what I'm saying? And then you just got extra stuff, clocks, stuff like that. So, like, the Boss Radio had a little bit more features as far as playing with it. Um, so, I mean, that's pretty much it, man. I recommend this radio. Um, but, you know, I always recommend higher radios since, it's like, you know, I recommend, like, Sony radios. Sony radios. Uh, uh, Pioneer flip-out screens. Um, you know, those are the top of the line. Yeah, they're going to cost you. This right here will run you, like, 150 on Amazon. You know, boss ones will run you like 120 to 150, but you know, I'll choose this over boss because boss is just a little um that last boss script out screen I had, that boss that last boss screen I had, it wasn't a flip out screen, it was a single den, but it had like a seven inch monitors, so it looked like it was like this, but it came like down, so it covered up like all of that. Yeah, that that right there was not the radio. That that right there was terrible. It had a terrible equalizer. It was just terrible. So, um, I recommend Power Acoustic. I don't know about those other screens like Pile and, you know, all those those other ones, those cheaper ones out there. But I recommend, high, I highly recommend, uh, if you just got the money, Sony, JVC, Pioneer, and Kenwood. Those three. And when it comes to screens, I'm going to say Kenwood and Pioneer are one of the, they're the best when it comes to screens, especially Pioneer with their, with their features as far as like playing with the music with the Hertz and the, you can have no bass on your door speakers, but only bass in your sub. And yeah, that's where, that's what you really want. But if you don't have the type of money like that and you just limited and you just want to just get some, just get a simple little flip out screen that's just going to do the job, this or Boss or Pile, but I recommend this over Boss and Pile. I don't know about pile. Pile. I had a pile amp, and it, it worked fine. But that shit used to cut out. I used to get tired of that shit. So that's the only thing about pile. But um, yeah, man. Um, it's all set up. You know, real good. I like it. I enjoy it. I recommend it. So if you guys looking for a screen, you know, get you one. Um, 
flip outs are cool they flip out you can get the single den it's it's called a single den but it has a double den screen and then you got the whole like double den like the ones that's like real big and bulky like that fat and they take up the whole thing you got those versions they got all kind of different versions of screens nowadays so i recommend the screen if you guys want to screen watch videos on it it's nice go ahead and get you one um so that's all i got to say recommend it get it uh so please rate comment subscribe i got videos coming man i got subwoofers uh you know i happen to get, i got my I, I got a subwoofer to show you guys i got one it's a good one um i got subwoofers i got a new amp i got everything now you know i even got speakers six by nines in the back here so i got videos coming man i even got a new phone that i'm recording on right now i gotta make a view a review on um all kind of stuff man so it's all coming soon um so yeah please rate comment subscribe catch you on my next video peace